हे गाइस वेलकम बैक टू द चैनल सो टुडे आई एम गोइंग टू गिव एन इंफॉर्मेशन कि वेन एवर पेशेंट इज कॉलिंग यू फॉर एनी पेन एंड एनी स्वेलिंग सो वॉट इज वॉट इज द आइडियल एंटीबायोटिक्स यू शुड गिव इट टू द पेशेंट सो दिस इज वेरी मच रिक्वायर्ड लाइक यू हैव टू लिसन टू द सिम्टम्स ऑफ द पेशेंट देन यू हैव टू डायग्नोज देन यू हैव टू गिव द मेडिसिन सो जस्ट गिविंग पेन किलर्स वोट डू द वर्क अलॉन्ग विद पेन किलर्स एन एस आई डीज यू टू हैव टू गिव एंटीबायोटिक्स अभी कौन सा इन्फेक्शन कौन सा एंटीबायोटिक दे ये जानना मुश्किल है सो देर आर वेरियस टाइप्स ऑफ इन्फेक्शन विच विल इनकाउंटर इन आवर प्रैक्टिस सो द फर्स्ट इन्फेक्शन वॉट वॉट वी यूजली इनकाउंटर इज वेन द पेशेंट कॉल्स यू इन केस ऑफ सिवियर पेन एंड स्वेलिंग सो समाइम्स द स्वेलिंग कम्स अलॉन्ग विद सेलुलाइटिस Sometimes the swelling is with a periapical abscess. Sometimes the swelling is with a dentoalveolar abscess. So, if there is a periapical infection of the tooth, if you don't give antibiotics and painkillers in proper time, it may lead to cellulitis. So, in order to prevent that, you have to tell few instructions to the patient. Like, the patient should not give any kind of warm fomentation of the swelling area. Otherwise, it may increase. The patient should not use any kind of amrutanjan or vix over the area where the swelling is there otherwise it will lead to more inflammation and more pain so what is the best antibiotic so basically we are why the swelling is there the swelling is basically due to streptococcus and staphylococcus aureus streptococcus pyogenes and staphylococcus aureus so these are all pus producing organisms so these are all aerobic organisms so you have to give any thing which kills these organisms like amoxicillin plus clavulanic acid combination now all the amoxicillin clavulanic acid present in the current market doesn't work i cannot tell you the names the best ones i'll tell you you can give augmentin which is the best i feel it works like wonders then next is you can give amoxiclav which is by abbott so these two medicines are there then sensiclav is another 625 mg medicine or indiclav these three four medicines will only work properly other brand medicines i don't they i don't rely on those medicines but these four companies they work really good but i'm not getting paid for telling this but this is the actual thing i have tested tried everything this really works wonders sensiclav best is augmentin then you can give amoxiclav from abbott company then you can give uh, sensiclav indiclav all these medicines work very nicely along with this you need to give a uh, pain killer which will instantly reduce the pain and you all know ketrolidity is the best it reduces the pain instantly and along with that don't give more than 2 to 4 tablets of ketrolidity along with that you should give some anti some pain killer like zerodal sp or you can give zerodal pt now you will be uh, telling me what is the difference between zerodal sp and pt sp is containing serrasipeptidase and acyclofenac Whereas PT is containing tramadol and paracetamol, so both works like wonders. Like with tramadol, like zero dal SP you give me once in the morning and zero dal PT you once you give in the evening. So PT me kya hota hai? Tramadol patient khayega, so thoda sa sleep bhi aayega patient ko. Patient will feel better the next morning. So this is one kind of uh, medicines and don't forget to give any gastritis medicines. Like what you are prescribing, you can write those kind of gastritis medicines to the patient. So ye ho gaya apka antibiotic painkiller. be sometimes the patient will be having swelling at the angle of the mandible patient won't be able to open the mouth right because the infection hota it has spread into the submesenteric space below the masseter muscle so that's why patient will be there and severe pain on in the angle of the mouth per you're not touching the patient you're only asking the patient via phone isliye ye wala video bana raha hu main to jab bhi patient uh, mouth opening karne mein bol raha hai ki difficulty ho raha hai to sare patient waise mein pain nahi hota due to infection also it can lead to trismus so that time you have to give some muscle relaxant along with the pain killers so what is the best muscle relaxant you can give to the patient you can give myospas you can give you can give zerodol pg it contains acyclofenac plus it contains pregabalin in controlled release formation many other pregabalin are also available but other pregabalin combinations cause huge amount of sleepiness you will patient will feel sleepy drowsy all day so if you give zerodol pg it contains sr sustained release pregabalin along with painkiller acyclofenac so that will reduce the pain eventually patient will be open, able to open the mouth and particularly this kind of patients where uh, they are not able to open the mouth i suggest give to give uh, intramuscular injection of dynapar or aqueous dynapar means diclofenac 75 mg intramuscular injection will drastically reduce the inflammation 
so this is must when patient is not able to open the mouth and the pain is excruciating pain not able to control by tablets or medicines then you have to give an injection you either you give it or you tell some medical professional to give it or some nurse to give it or in the medicine store also they are giving dinapur aq injection in the pathological lab also uh, people are giving intramuscular injections so you can tell those patients who are calling you from far away to find any pathological lab or medicine store they'll be they will give you the medicines so these are the things so another antibiotic which you can give sometimes patient will be telling you that there is no pain but there is a swelling along with some pus formation will be there so in these cases basically it is due to anaerobic organisms ab anaerobic organisms kis mein hota hai red complex yellow complex jo hota hai periodontitis periodontitis mein jo proformer hai gingivalis streptococcus denticola and actinobacillus bacillus actinomycobacterium jo hota hai a a jisko bolte hain so against that few medicines are there which works like wonder is is clindamycin you can give or you can give metronidazole or you can give satronidazole isko uh, satrogil bolte hain satrogil o these medicines are there which helps to reduce the anaerobic infections very nicely particularly if the patient is diabetic with swelling with pain and infection also then you can give both augmentin and metronidazole 400 mg twice daily for 5 days patient will definitely have relief that day i went to the hospital and the patient came all the way 120 km away patient was uh, i don't know why he came in the lockdown period for such a on 2nd april he came and uh, he came into the hospital with a complaint of severe periodontitis and halitosis so i said it's not an emergency why i have come but she is telling me that sir i am not able to control the pain and i am not able to control the halitosis so i saw there was a huge inflammation in the lingual side of the lower anterior teeth so what i gave is i gave him a good mouthwash i gave him tantum oral rinse and along with that the tantum contains benzaldehyde hydrochloride and along with that i gave him gave her uh, metronidazole 400 mg twice daily for 10 days i have given to that patient i think now she is fine along with that i have given a gum astringent stolid so these are the common complaints you will get pain ho raha hai sir muh nahi khul raha so these kind of patients you can without touching the patient by listening to the symptoms you can give some amount of treatment now comes the severely diabetic patients so in this i would uh, suggest you have you have to give clindamycin 600 mg like dalacin c you can give to this patient antibiotic painkiller is as usual zero dol sp is your favorite india's favorite zero dol sp you can give or you can give any other painkiller like uh, flamar 3d it works very nicely and you can also give uh, many are there many are there in the available the market no so uh, in diabetic patients who are uncontrolled you can give dalacin c 600 mg or you if the if it's possible you can patient uh, can be given intra intravenous intravenous traxol s 1.5 g or odcf s uh, 1.5 g it contains cefixim one uh, cefixim combination so third generation cephalosporin but before that i will tell you to avoid this drug because you need to do a sensitivity testing over the skin right so that's why it's very important to avoid these kind of medicines now because there is no hospital to monitor these kind of patients because if there is any complication you will be in soup so always in diabetic patients be very careful tell the patient to manage by taking augmentin otherwise you can give augmentin 1 g for 5 days to these patients augmentin amoxicillin clavulanic acid 1 g combination you can give along with clindamycin or you can give metronidazole to these kind of pa- patients so even higher antibiotics i will tell you avoid during this time because it may lead to complications it may you lead to hypersensitivity or anaphylactic reactions so you can give normal medicines as per your knowledge so along with this few patients who are pregnant also they will call you right the pregnant patients ko kya de so if the patient is in second trimester of pregnancy you can only give plain amoxicillin 500 mg without clavulanic acid or if you give clavulanic acid you don't know whether the patient is taking correctly or not you won't be able to monitor the patient so that's why it's always safe to be on safer side so give amoxicillin 500 mg along with that you can give paracetamol 650 mg which is otherwise known as dolo 650 it's available easily in the market or dolo 650 patient din mein agar do bar bhi khayega pregnant patient in the second trimester of pregnancy nothing will happen you can give easily similarly in kidney patients kidney problems having chronic kidney disease 
So these kind of patients excrete the NSAIDs through the kidney. So you have to avoid NSAIDs in kidney patients. However, you can give one tablet. It won't cause if the patient is in severe pain in kidney disease, particularly chronic kidney disease, not in acute kidney disease. You cannot give NSAIDs in acute kidney disease, but chronic kidney disease, okay, you can give one tablet, but not more than that. So what you will do in these kind of patients? You have to give, I think you can give... Um, uh, one of my senior patients, they, her wife, she had kidney problems. So, uh, after the extraction, they told me, eh, sir, I have kidney problem. Before that, they didn't tell anything in the medical history. Somehow, they got scared and they told me. So, many people will be hiding the history also. So, these kind of people, had like they have to be properly dealt with. So, I gave the patient only Dolo 650 two times a day. So, that will reduce the pain to some intake. Although, it's an antipyretic drug, but to some extent, it is analgesic also. So, you have to give... Doro 650 in kidney patients and in pregnant patients. So these are the cases, complications you will get. Remaining cases, koi bolta hai cap nikal gaya, koi bolta hai thoda swelling aaya hai to everybody unko bolo aap ki abhi nahi ho sakta because the number of cases of COVID-19 are increasing in India and we need to take care as dentists are highly risk for getting the disease and spreading the disease also because we only work with aerosols. Hamara zindagi aerosol hai. Har cheez mein hamara aerosol hai. Aerotor hai. Scalar hai. Dunia wali chize hai. We have to work with saliva and this thing spreads through this. Saliva, contamination, all those things is there. And we are most close to the patient. Uh, we are almost not even one feet away from the patient. So, the chances of getting upper and lower respiratory tract infection is very high to the dentist. As well as who are nearby the dentist, your assistant, patient, attender, everybody. So... My opinion will be that to avoid patient as till the lockdown is over, avoid patients and give medicines on phone and uh, don't go near, just tell over telephonic conversation. I hope you got, uh, you come like you came across many antibiotics and all those things through this video. If it's good, please like it. If there's a query on Instagram, please ask. Sai Dental Vlogs. Have a very good day. Or lockdown period ko आपने जो अगर पिछले वीडियो नहीं देखा तो मैंने सारे डेंटिस्ट का उसमें वीडियो डाला हुआ है मजा आएगा आपको देखिएगा